Hi, crafty friends. You guys, I was so excited when I found this clay yesterday. I found it in the white, but I also found it in the terracotta. So what we're gonna do is we are going to use that. We're gonna use a little doily and some cookie cutouts, and we're gonna make some really cool ornaments. So y'all know I love fast and easy crafts. This one takes time only because we're waiting for those little guys to air dry, but I decided to add a fan to it. That way they could sit there with the fan on it and they dried really fast. So I was super excited about that. So you can see I just flattened it. I'm gonna lay the doily on top and then I'm just going to smush that down into the clay. And it's about the size of the clay, I guess. Mine are going to be, my uh, ornaments that we're doing here are going to be completely full of this lace. Um, design. You could do just the edges of it. You could do stripes of it. You could do a lot of different things, but I thought, look how cute that is. Oh my gosh. The circle cutter, the flower cutter, and then the other one is a leaf. I know it's kind of crazy looking, but I'm going to save that one for the terracotta. So I just kind of did like when we're doing cookies, um, just kind of pull all of the clay away. I put a little hole in the top. Um, I don't have anything to do that other than this pencil um, that doesn't have an eraser anymore, but it worked out great. Uh, so then once I did that, I just kind of pushed it down on the back just so that it would lay nice and good. And um, then I was like, all right, let's get started once I got those all cut out with the terracotta. And as I was doing this, I was like, oh man, my doily is going to get terracotta color. But you guys, it was perfectly fine. It didn't get any of the color on it. So that was really cool because my hands sure got dirty. So I was excited about that. Uh, so again, once it's all dried up, I took these white ones and I've got this like shimmer gold um, acrylic paint. And I thought, I'm gonna paint these. I'm gonna see what this looks like. And I got a little heavy handed in some of the spots. I was loving the glittery, not glittery, the glistening, I should say, of it. So what I decided to do was once that paint dried, which was actually really quick, is I took a little bit of sandpaper to it and just kind of roughed up where I got just a little bit too much. I hit the edges as well um, with the gold, but it they turned out super cool. So you can see I just kind of have an assortment of things, some wire and some um, beads and some the little tiny bells. And I just thought, we're just going to jazz these up however we want. I mean, you could make them totally simple and just hang some twine around them and be done. But I thought it would be just kind of fun to, you know, add some different things. This is like when I'm taking signs apart or stuff like that, I save all the pieces because you never know when you're going to use them. So look how adorable these turned out. I'm obsessed with these, especially the gold ones. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. All right, friends, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and don't forget to follow the page for more.